Friendsgiving. One tradition that many people have adopted in recent years is a gathering called Friendsgiving. It is a time when those who aren't related by blood gather together to celebrate and give thanks for the gift of friendship. As someone who has spent many years living far away from family, my heart is warmed by the whole concept of Friendsgiving. It's an intentional choice to celebrate what a person has been given instead of getting caught up in what may be missing. Couldn't we all benefit from that sort of practice? Anyone who is separated from family due to death, distance, or broken relationships knows that the sting of loss is particularly sharp during the fall and holiday season. It can seem as if you're the only one alone, but we would be shocked as how many people aren't surrounded by family. Yet we have this beautiful promise in scripture that God stakes the lonely and sets them in families of his making. It may be co-workers, neighbors, fellow students, or a church community. People we never would have expected suddenly become an integral part of our lives. Some of the greatest gifts God bestows on us are the people He places in our lives. Our Father sees us in our solitude. It's aware of every loss and knows how to rescue the godly from trials. One of the ways He often chooses to rescue us is through friends. How often we had a friend walk through the trial with us, share their story, simply sit with us. We call them friends. We could, it, it could be that God calls them family. Before allowing losses to become the theme of our season, we can make a list of all the people God has strategically placed in our lives. Maybe we thought it was coincidence that we moved in next to someone who became a dear friend or that our new co-worker had such similar interest. Let's take a moment and recognize the family God has intentionally created for us. Then we can invite them all together for Friendsgiving. Five ways to give back. Buy groceries for a family in need. Volunteer at a food bank. Visit a nursing home. Invite someone to your family Thanksgiving. Send cards of great gratitude to people who have blessed you.